Hey guys, so I'm going to tell you about the under the sink essentials. This is the garbage disposer. This particular thing is a garbage disposer. And then there's a reset button in the under this. That's a reset button. You see that? There is a reset button here. God, where is it? Here. It's a reset button if the disposer doesn't work. Okay? And this one, this pipe is a sewage pipe. So this one goes right here, right here to the sewage downstairs. So you could see that down. So it goes there. And then you could see this little wire here. This wire is has a out outlet on this side. So you see that outlet there? Yes, ma'am. This is the outlet. And this is really important because if this is loose, if this is loose, this has to be tight enough for the garbage disposer to work. I'm gonna show you the garbage disposer in a minute. And this is basically our sink sewage pipe. So this is basically our sink sewage pipe where it all goes down. So one sink, there are two sinks I have. So one sink is just going down to the sewage and one sink has a garbage disposer fit to it. So it all goes to the sewer on the other side. And then there is of course a small pipe. You see the small pipe here? This is to the dishwasher. This is to the dishwasher here. So these two wires down there are for the dishwashers, of the dishwasher on this side. This basically on the other side is the dishwasher. So I'll show you. There is a dishwasher. So this goes to the other side. These two pipes, okay? And this outlet this electricity plug and outlet is for the garbage disposer and this basically sewage is for this sink and this is for this sink. So my garbage disposer did not work in the morning and I was trying to figure out what it is but because there was no electricity supply to it but now I saw that this particular this particular electricity point there to the outlet was loose so I actually tightened it and my gosh garbage disposer started working so i'm going to show you how a garbage disposer looks the garbage disposer looks like this basically it's it's connected to the sink put these away so this one it's connected to the sink like this and and then there is a little switch here that you had to Press. So once you press this, the garbage disposer starts working. Oh, you know what? It's not working anymore. Eh, maybe I made it loose. Hold on, guys. Let me tighten it. So, so there it is. Here we are. And here it is. And I'm going to switch this on. So you put the water in. And then put the water in. The noise you hear is actually the garbage disposer. So this is done for this one. And on the under the sink thing is really important. But as to what you are actually placing under the sink. So the way I place it is I have a little scotch bright that I put on one side. That's a scotch right, And then I have the dishwasher pack, the dishwasher little, little thingies that goes in. And what really happens to this is the, the, the plastic melts and then the dishwasher powder is taken over by the dishwasher. You know the better one now, I think is the one without a plastic or you know the one like this. I have one like this. I think this is probably the better one now. And what else do I have here? I have a little, I have a little stainless steel starter because I have some stainless steel stuff that um, I use. Then I have a little Mr. Clean. This is a magic eraser. I have with this. And what I have is a trash bag. The, uh, the trash bags are big trash bags. These are bags that I used basically for my, for my, you see that? It's a 40 liter. That one is what it is used for. 
and what else I have here is a little dishwasher which I'll be using. This is a replacement for the dishwasher that I have upstairs. So there's a little dishwasher and then what I have is a disinfecting wipes. I'm going to just wipe it once. So look at that. It looks so yuck and I'm going to just wipe it once. And then I have a little um, distilled vinegar for my uh, for cleaning up and some baking soda it's supposed to be very good to leave baking soda for cleaning and and of course I have the hand soap refill which I refill upstairs with the hand soap and then a little mop thingy that I have to clean up the dirt around so that's basically what the under the sink looks like but I wanted to be extremely sure about what I'm showing you as regards to the sewer pipes, the garbage disposal, and the two pipes that are heading to the um, dishwasher. So, uh, gosh, if that gets loose, my, dish, my garbage disposal doesn't work. So I, I need to figure out how to keep it tight at all times. I don't know about these two little, these two little pipes. I need to still find out what those are. And once I come to know that, I can do another video on those two pipes and those two little pipes going to the dishwasher when I'm install when we are installing the dishwasher next. Um, see you guys. Have fun.